Hey guys, Brian here. Welcome to my lab. Thanks for joining me today on episode 2 of Brian's Favorite Geckos. Now this is the show where we get hands-on with some of my favorite animals, talk a little bit more about crested gecko morphs, and what exactly I like about each of them. Now I got a good lineup of geckos for you today. Let's get right into it with the first one we have to look at. First up today we have this male white-walled pinstripe. Now I absolutely love this black and white combo. This guy's got a really nice solid cream dorsal, very nice cream sides, absolute great contrast between the light and the dark. As far as more traditional dark based pinstripes go, this is one of my favorite combinations. Next up we have a C2 creamsicle pinstripe. Now creamsicles obviously as you know are orange and white geckos. Creamsicle pinstripes are absolutely gorgeous. The C2 gene is a little bit misunderstood. It originally was a line of very bright clean orange geckos like this but the C2 gene, it is a dominant gene, it's a form of hypomelanism. So what it does is it erases dark pigment and that's why you get the really bright clean looking animals just like this girl here. Next up today we have one of my favorite extreme harlequin breeders. Now this girl, I love her pattern. She's got a really dark base color and nice yellow harlequin markings that go all the way up to reach her dorsal. Very beautiful, great coverage. And she also has the big white spots on her sides you can see there. Really good structure, a nice wide head. These are the kind of extreme harlequin girls that I like working with. Now this guy here is my absolute favorite Halloween that I own. He's part of our zombie line. As you can see, he's got that super dark jet black base color and orange markings. Color-wise for Halloweens, he's second to none in our collection. He's absolutely gorgeous. With Halloweens, I like a minimalistic approach. That real dark base color, lots of black base color, and just a little bit of orange markings as kind of a highlight. So you can see this guy has almost nothing on his sides, an almost empty dorsal, just those bright orange pins on a black gecko, absolutely gorgeous. Now my final gecko for today is a beautiful tricolor. This girl was hatched by Cotswold geckos over in England. She is absolutely gorgeous as you can see with that gray base color, those orange harlequin markings and that beautiful white sides. Tricolors are one of the most stunning geckos, certainly the best looking harlequins, and I can't wait to breed this girl and see what her offspring are going to look like. That's it for today. Thank you so much for watching our video. Click here to subscribe to our channel and keep updated on all of our videos. Click here to see more videos we've already posted. Take a minute to visit us at www.altitudeexotics.com and for all things geckos, check us out on Facebook at facebook.com slash aegeckos. Thank you guys so much and have a great day.